the problem statement doesn't indicate whether to give your answers in radians or in degrees. So I'm going to assume degrees for now. And if you want to solve this equation for theta, uh, theta is the angle that has a tangent of 2.9 or the inverse tangent of 2.9 or you can use arc tangent of 2.9. I like to say to myself theta is the angle that has a tangent of 2.9 and a calculator will only give you one value this one right here in degrees <clears throat> but it turns out there's infinitely many angles that have a tangent at 2.9 if you think of yourself on a circle in this case with the radius of 2.9 uh, this theta right here is the 70.97 degrees because it, ha it has a tangent of 2.9. The opposite side is 2.9. Oh, the radius is not 2.9. This height is 2.9. Uh, and this distance is 1. So the tangent of theta is 2.9 over 1. But there's another angle down here in the third quadrant that has the same ratio, negative 2.9 over negative 1. And that angle is 180 degrees more than this theta. The period of the tangent function is 180 degrees, or pi radians. <clears throat> so we could say that theta equals 70.97 plus 180k degrees where k is any integer. Well, if k can be any integer, that means there are infinitely many solutions. As you go around this circle, evolving this initial side, either in a positive direction or counterclockwise or this way, you, as long as you end up on one of these terminal rays, you've got an angle that has a tangent of 2.9. Now, so when it asks for six specific solutions, those aren't the only ones. You get to choose. So you could let K equal, whoop, let K equal 0, 1, two, three, four, and five. And you get numbers like 70.97 when K is zero. When K is one, you get 70.97 plus 180 or 250.97 and so on. You could also let K equal uh, zero, one, two, negative one, negative two, one, two, three, four, and maybe negative three. <clears throat> and then compile your list of angles that have a value, a uh, tangent of 2.9. But again, this is how you would represent infinitely many solutions of that equation. And if you wanted to do it in radians, you'd say theta equals one point two, four, rounded to two decimal places, plus k pi, where k is any integer. And then if you wanted to get six specific solutions, again, you would let k be zero, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, but you can list as many solutions as you want. Okay, there you go. Hope that helped. If you have any questions, post a comment.